Dear Mr. Aston, I want to thank you for the opportunity to work for such a great company like Tyron Bank. I truly consider it a privilege to be a part of this family. Even though I've only been here for a short time, I can already tell I'm going to love it here. I also, also want, want to thank you for the generous donation Town made to Stonebridge School, where my children attend. I understand. Dear Mr. Aston, I'm so happy to be part of this fantastic organization. I tell my wife I feel like I've died and gone to heaven. I'm looking forward to the Dear exciting Bob, years ahead. I tell members of my team, even a bad day at town is better than a good day at the bank across the street. The work environment and community involvement at town cannot be relevant. Letters and notes, words of acknowledgement, tend to line the fabric of our lives. Kind words can remind us of the past. Where we came from can often help us see where we're going. As shareholders, sometimes it's good to pause and be reminded. We really have built something wonderful here, haven't we? It was all about friendships and relationships. It was about bringing people together. It was about creating a strong sense of belonging. It was about making people feel special every day they walk through the doors of our bank. Sometimes it seems like only yesterday. Remember, the bank that started in a room over a garage. <laughs> but yesterday has been almost two decades now. When uh, we came together to form the bank, uh, our most noble purpose was really to create a great community asset for Hampton Roads. And with that, it all began. Literally changing the state of banking in our hometown to the extent that today, people cannot help but notice. Dear Mr. Aston, it's clear that core earnings are good, and while that's important, it's really happening because of Town Bank's distinctive people-centered culture. Ultimately, when people really care about people and it's sincere, other people feel it and are drawn to it. When we look at what really matters most in our lives, it's other people and what we've done to help them live better lives. It's a perfect combination when a company can do both so well. A successful company and a caring company. A notion as true today as it was in years past. You know, I, I love being with successful people and being a part of successful organizations. You know, one thing they do, they're profitable. When you're profitable, you're, you have the means to give back to the community. When a company can be so successful financially and do it in a way that really matters to all of the people who it serves, and that's Town Bank. Dear Bob, I just finished reading Town Today, your monthly publication, and you and your associates have done an outstanding job in serving our community and beyond. When I was a founding member with another bank, we always compare your bottom line with ours. And our president used to say, I just don't know how they are doing it. How do they do it? About 11 years ago, one of our directors expressed it best. The giving to the community, the caring for the community is not a corporate policy. It is a corporate culture, and to me, that's a distinct difference. That culture is the foundation of Town Bank's legacy. It's a corporate legacy of changing people's lives for the better. Today is my six month anniversary at Town. You have created an organization of excellence that inspires me to want to be great every day. Dear Bob, I have only been part of town for a short time, but it has changed my life. I'm a far better person for this experience. I can't believe it's been 10 years I've been a Beetle driver, and I enjoyed it as much today as I did the first day. I wanted to take the time to express my deepest appreciation for the opportunity to fulfill my banking career here at Town Bank. Right from the beginning, nearly 20 years now, during this time, I was able to send my son Matt to Boston College and my daughter Meredith to North Carolina State University. I am truly appreciative to you and town for what you have provided to me and my family. The effect of our legacy is best seen in the many faces of those whose lives we have touched for the past nearly 20 years. For many, it often becomes necessary to choose between paying rent and giving their children a healthy meal. On behalf of the thousands of neighbors we serve, Thank you for your generous pledge. With kind regards, Feedmore's Food Bank, Meals on Wheels, and Community Kitchen. Let's take my kids, who we serve. What do you think their most favorite morning is of the week? It's Monday. They get off the bus, laughing, screaming, whistling, skipping into school. And why is that? Because they get breakfast. And why are they happy? Because they may not have eaten all weekend. 
Dear Town Bank, Julia faces many challenges in life. She has already survived four brain surgeries and faces the fear every day of being permanently disabled. Equikids is a place where Julia can forget, where she can leave the seriousness of her condition outside the door than just be a kid with a horse. This lady walked in with her daughter, and her daughter has developmental delay, and you know she really wanted something for her daughter. I worked with her throughout the eight-week lesson. When her lesson was over, she looked at me, and she just burst into tears, and she said, you know, my daughter now has something of her own. And um, that's what we do here. We give them something of their own. Dear Mr. Aston, on behalf of Edmark Hospice for Children, I want to thank you and the Town Bank Foundation. The gift will allow us to provide care at the highest level ever. There will be more light during a family's darkest time caring for a child with a catastrophic illness. Edmark is the pediatric hospice program here in Hampton Roads. Walking this journey and going this journey, nobody wants to do this. The parents will often say to us, we didn't have a choice, but you all do. And you still make that choice to be with us. We're not really sure how in the world would we have gotten through this without you. And a past United States Senator, now president of a local university, writes, Town Bank's partnership changes life every day at Christopher Newport, touching the hearts and minds of extraordinary young women and men who grace our campus. For any school, support like Town Bank's is enormously empowering. For Christopher Newport, it is transforming. My years in Washington convinced me that the future of this world is not going to be shaped by great nation states or powerful parliaments or mighty armies, but rather by people like you and me who are willing to engage and lead and serve and love and make the world a better place. That's what Town Bank is doing each and every day. And another letter. This one from the American Bankers Association. We are pleased to announce Elizabeth Beth Prever has been named the ABA Foundation's 2017 George Bailey Distinguished Service Award recipient. The ABA honors six banks annually for their commitment to their communities. This is the only award given to an individual. Add to that a personal note from the actual American Bankers Association president and CEO saying, we were saddened to hear of Beth's passing. She represented the very best of our industry. Dear Bob, I feel like every time I turn around, I'm reminded of the genuine care and concern town has for its people and our community. The greatest joy I have is calling town my home. Thank you for the gift of your friendship, Beth. The Town Bank legacy will always be one of combining business success with caring for our community. And with it, we set in motion a momentum of serving others and enriching lives that will go on forever. When we look at what really matters most in our lives, it's other people and what we've done to help them live better lives. It's not a corporate policy. It is a corporate culture. That's how you change the world. And that's why it's important that you do all that you're doing.